Hello, my name is Benjamin Hart. I'm an American attorney and the managing director of Integrity Legal here in Bangkok, Thailand. As the title of this video suggests, we're discussing the exemption from quarantine scheme here in Thailand. And I wanted to go ahead and just throw this up on the, this is from the MFA website, mfa.go.th. And this is basically information regarding the different sort of schemes. And I use the scheme, word scheme sort of in the British sense. In the American sense, sometimes has kind of a nefarious connotation. But in the, in the, in the British sense, it's, it's just sort of program, what we would say, you know, the exemption from quarantine program. And this is to provide, provide a little bit of clarification. You know, what is this? We've been kind of saying, I guess euphemistically or colloquially, that we've gone to a quarantine-free process. Now, strictly speaking, that's not quite exactly true. There's this brief kind of interregnum for those who meet the requirements associated with the exemption from quarantine scheme, but there's still some testing required, as noted in this in prior videos. For example, one final PCR test where you've got to be determined to be negative for COVID-19, and then you're sort of on your way. And the... Just a quote directly from this, from this uh, Thailand Plus FAQs. Again, this is at mfa.go.th. It's provided by the Department of Consular Affairs, Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Here on bullet point 11, can I travel in Thailand freely if I have entered through the exemption from quarantine scheme? And the answer, exemption from quarantine scheme, you can travel to any destinations in Thailand once the RT-PCR test upon arrival received is negative. So you kind of go through this brief delay, it appears, and we're, we're currently just seeing this come online. So, you know, I don't know exactly how the practicalities of this are gonna play out over the coming days and weeks, but this is what it looks like. You come in, you do a final test, and you sort of move on down the conveyor belt, if you will, and off you go uh, to enjoy travel here in Thailand. But it is a massive improvement over the 14-day quarantine. We were dealing with not even, I mean, it's been even a little less, at least as of the time of this video, a little less than a month ago. And a lot of folks had to undergo that, and that wasn't the most pleasant thing. It was keeping a lot of people from coming. Hopefully, this new program will encourage more folks to come to Thailand, because we certainly want to see you come through here. There are some folks who may find that some of the current aspects of processing to get not only a visa, but to also get the Thailand pass get into Thailand may be a little bit frustrating or overwhelming. For those folks, it may not be a terrible idea to contact a legal professional, gain some insight and guidance into how best to proceed.